Spring training 2021. Will we even have it? What will it be like? Join me as I explore Tempe Diablo Stadium, home of Mike Trout and the Anaheim Angels, coming up next. It's been exactly one year since my spring training tour of the Cactus League was stopped in its tracks due to COVID. But hope springs eternal. In 2021, we have spring training baseball, and I get to visit a few ballparks this year that I haven't visited. The first one is going to be Tempe Diablo in Tempe, Arizona, home of the Angels. Obviously, spring training would have a different feel this year as the ballparks would only allow limited capacity fans in the, in the stands. In fact, this is as close as we could get without paid seats to the players. But we were lucky enough to get a ball thrown up to us. Tempe Diablo Stadium opened up in 1968 and actually went through a renovation in 2005. Another big question mark I had going into the Cactus League this year was how would the food be at the stadiums? Being as that I was so uncertain about the food at the stadiums, we decided to eat beforehand. So we grabbed a nice cup of Italian ice cream and our buddy Tark ended up getting one of the corn dogs. Yep. I got bumbo, watermelon, and pineapple. Bite into it. No, I don't think so. Okay, it's just water and we'll dry. It's nice. It's a nice hot day. Food wasn't bad. Not bad. There wasn't too many options, but it was definitely pretty good. The sight lines are one of the best features of the ballpark, as you can be pretty close to the action from any vantage point inside the ballpark. Now normally, in most years, I would rate the ballpark based on price availability of admission and parking. But being as how this year is so different, I don't think that uh, that applies. In fact, this year tickets were really hard to get because they went on sale and within two days everybody had scooped up tickets. I will say one silver lining though is that parking is either free or very cheap. In fact, we parked for free at this ballpark. Number three, Taylor Wolf. Another feature at the ballparks this year as a result of the pandemic is pod seating on the berms. They have this little white box that you and whoever you have decided you want to take to the ball game get to sit in without a mask. We decided we wanted to venture out into the area to see if we could get some views and to see what the atmosphere was like out on the berms. Directly behind the berm there is one of the only places in the ballpark you can find shade. And if you try really hard you might be able to get a ball thrown at you. I'm going to stick with my number 9 ranking of Tempe Diablo Stadium from last year's top 10 list due to the fact that the stadium doesn't really have any monitor amenities as the scoreboard is old school and doesn't have any of the frills of the new ballparks. The food, although is good, it's very limited and the access to players is very limited. Thanks for watching.